This video shows examples of how sorting data against columns can give you unexpected results if underlying values differ from the text displayed in grid cells. In a similar manner, you'll see how a sort order can change for numeric or date time columns if their values are treated as strings. You'll also learn how the grid determines when to sort data using cell display text or using actual column values. Plus see the property you can use to manually switch from one mode to another. The grid usually sorts data exactly how you expect it to do it. When you sort against a column containing text data, like name, you get it sorted in alphabetical order. If you sort numeric or date time columns, you'll get numbers sorted from smallest to largest or dates from earliest to latest. Now take a look at the priority column that uses a cell editor to transform underlying priority values of 1, 2, and 3 to the corresponding textual descriptions, low, medium, and high. When I click the column header, I expect the values to be sorted from low to high or vice versa. In reality, data is sorted in alphabetical order, where high is followed by low and only then by medium. Let's go to design time and fix the sort mode for this column. First, let's see how the assigned image combo box in place editor is set up. Expand the column edit property and access the editor's items collection by clicking the ellipsis button for the items property. Look at the value and description properties. Low corresponds to 1, medium to 2, and high to 3. Now you can be sure the grid can properly sort data based on those underlying values. Access the priority column settings and see that its sort mode property is set to default. In other words, the grid view automatically determines what kind of sorting to use. For columns with image combo box or lookup edit editors, this means sorting by display text rather than values. It makes sense because these columns usually display names extracted by ID from another table, and you'd rather organize those names alphabetically than by IDs which you won't see. On the other hand, this doesn't work with statuses, where sorting by IDs makes sense, while alphabetical sorting doesn't. So to force sorting by values, switch the sort mode property to value. Now let's run the application and click the priority column header. As a result, this column cells are sorted in ascending order according to their edit values of 1, 2, and 3. With any other editor types, the grid view sorts values, which is the expected behavior. Numbers go from smallest to biggest and dates are arranged from the earliest to latest. If you were to switch from value sorting to display text mode, then 10 or 100 would appear before 2, since 1 is less than 2 and strings are simply compared character by character. To enable this mode, you'll need to manually switch the sort mode property to display text. Now let's try this in action. Sort the created date column to see that dates are arranged as expected from the earliest to the latest. After that, go to the properties grid displaying the column settings and change the sort mode property to display text. See how 11 and 12 appear before 2, and notice that the year portion doesn't seem to be taken into account. 